Well, the moment of truth. What sort of dumbass leaves their address laying around inside a VR headset anyway? This came from. Oh, that's one of my projects. Thank you so much. Ah, no, I'm not giving it to you just like that. Uh, of course you are. Give it to me. No, I'm not. You're gonna fill me in on everything. Everything? Really? Yes, everything. Now tell me why there's a goddamn portal inside my shack. I have no clue what you're on about, mate. The portal, you know, the thing this thing was sent through. Honestly, it doesn't ring a bell. How I lost that thing is the simple fact that it just disappeared. Uh, okay. Listen, right? Uh, come inside. I'll, um, I'll tell you all about it. What the hell is this? Did you become a conspiracy theorist? No, no, no. This is real. Trust me. Next, you'll be telling me you joined a cult. Well, back when you and your friends put me out of a job by destroying the prison I was working in, I spent a lot of time to think. During this time, I lost the will to focus on my current hobbies. I took an interest in repairing things because repairing small things made me feel better about what I lost. As time went on, I got into more than just repairing things. I took to the deep web to find projects and it took a turn for the worst. Oh, a project from the deep web took a turn for the worst. Whoa, surprising. These projects, well, they weren't the average project, to say the least. They seemed to be what I thought was unique creations someone had dumped online, but I didn't know what I was going to be creating until I actually created them. I just thought they were going to be harmless. Dumped instructions on the deep web, harmless? Harmless? I followed each instruction for every project carefully, as I was just curious to what I was just making. Some were pointless crap, and some were, well, interesting to say the least. A headset, for example? I thought it was way too smart to be a headset. You could play games just about anywhere without being connected to anything. I don't even know where the games were coming from, but it was way smarter than it led on. Yeah, we sort of already knew. We plugged it into our friend's computer, and apparently it took over the entire goddamn network because it was a virus. I knew it! When it teleported itself away, I knew it was just more than that. So it did make a portal. Probably did. I, I was just making these things, I don't really know. Absolutely clueless. We just need closure and you're making it goddamn worse. Sorry bossy boots, but I have other things on my mind right now. Fine, just tell me about the projects you've been working on. If that was just the beginning, well, what the hell do the others do? Right, you won't believe me at first, but I'm telling you now. I've discovered other universes. There are more universes out there than our own. There's no way in hell you discovered other universes. Hell, I couldn't even do that. This is where all these pictures came from. They're not of me, they're of other me men. This cable, you plug it into the TV and it shows you the other dimensions. I was watching it for hours. I was so immersed in other universes. I was watching myself watching other people. It was crazy. You're joking, right? Of a man of science, you have to believe me, right? What the hell is this? This headset you made keeps teleporting. Yeah, it takes like two seconds to get to its destination. I don't know what's up with that. It's weird. If what I'm thinking is true, it's not just teleporting. It's going two seconds into the future. That would explain the delay. What the hell have you been doing, me man? You're messing with things you don't even know anything about. Hey, fun, right? You can't be doing this. You know what time travel means, right? It makes life meaningless now that you can go back and forward through time. Calm down, I haven't mastered it yet. But I could. I could go to other universes. I could save myself from dying. I could bring people back. 
No, you idiot. You can't just do whatever the hell you want with time travel. You can't just bring people back just because you feel like it. I'll see myself out then. No, I'm taking all this crap with me. I'm going to take it back to the shack. I'm going to figure out what the hell it does. And I'm going to destroy it. Along with that portal. Thank you. Oh, and I'm taking your toolkit as well. No, not the toolkit. I'll have to buy another one. No! See you around, buddy. I still have the instructions. You forgot to take those. <laughs> I could go around. I could save myself from other universes. I could stop myself from dying. <laughs> Me, man, forever.